All right, what's up, guys? You're back here with another album review, and today we're looking at Hollywood Undead's debut album from 2008, Swan Songs. This is the album that really got me into Hollywood Undead. I mean, it's got Black Dahlia on it. Like, Black Dahlia and Sell Your Souls on it. I think A Knife Called Lust is on it. But there's so many iconic Hollywood and Dead songs on here, like Number 5 and Young. But this album is so fucking good. I don't know what to say about it. This album really introduces you to the kind of sound that Hollywood Undead puts out there. And it really works out. It really does. Not to mention... Uh, see, the thing that I like about Hollywood Undead is... It's not just one singer. It's not just one melody. It's multiple different melodies. And I think people really underrate Hollywood Undead. It, they don't use one singer. They use multiple singers. There's six different people singing. I mean, Johnny Three. Uh, you, you got Johnny Three. You got uh, J Dog. You got uh, Charlie Sheen. Charlie Sh Charlie Sheen. I, I call him Charlie Sheen because that's what it sounds like. <laughs> you got Charlie Sheen. <laughs> uh, you also got a uh, oh that, fuck that's three of them. Uh, ah, god damn it! I can't remember the other three. That's the only ones I can think of. But Hollywood Undead has just always had an iconic sound. And you know what? That's why Psalms disappointed me, because Psalms really didn't have any variety. Yeah, Bloody Nose definitely had variety. Bloody Nose is a good song, but other than that, the other two suck ass. There was no variety between the two of them. It was just generic pop. But I really don't know what to say other than that. Uh, remember to comment, like, and subscribe. And we'll be back here probably with the last two Hollywood Undead reviews. <laughs> it's a hair on my scream. What the fuck?